Hi, I'm Steve from TechnoWorks, and today I'm going to tell you about cables. Cables are really important. If you're doing a DIY security system or a DIY CCTV system or controlling something around the house like putting a remote to a garage door, it's important to know what type of cable, and there's many different cables on the market. All these cables here are available from TechnoWorks, and you'll find them all on our online store where you can purchase the cable. You can also purchase the cable by a drum of like a 100 meter drum, or you can also buy it in a cut length. If you only need 30 meters of a cable, you can actually buy 30 meters of the cable as well. So I'll just go through some of these cables on the board here. This first one here is called figure eight. And the reason it's called figure eight is if you look at the end profile, it looks like the number eight. But this is a multi-strand. This one here is actually 24020. And what that makes it means is there's 24 strands at 0 0.020 per strand. So this is a, a multi-strand cable. It's used for things like speakers, it's used for power control, like powering devices as well. It comes in different um, gauges, so it goes up in size. This is a 42 strand, this is an 84 strand cable, so it just gets thicker and thicker. These can carry more current. Obviously, the bigger the cable, the more strands, the more current it can carry. There's also specialized audio cables where it's designed for uh, audio systems, and we do sell some audio stuff on TechnoWorks. Then there's different coaxial cables, and coaxial cables are used for things like analog or TDI video. Um, basically, still uses a uh, coaxial cable, and a coax cable is basically a copper sheath around a insulator and a copper center. Um, there's also things like RG50, uh, RG6. This one here, RG6, is actually used for TV, pay TV, and it's actually a quad shield, so there's actually four shields. A little bit different to the uh, copper made coaxial cable. This is actually has a steel center that's copper coated and it has four layers of foil um, screening on it. Again, that's typically used for, for RF type and that's what it's RG radio grade six is what the RG six is. The next one is cables that are very um, useful, which is the data cables. Uh, they, they come in either CAD 5E or CAD 6. Um, CAD 6 being able to carry more data and be able to carry the data longer distances. Typically, um, CAD 5E can carry data up to 90 meters before you need to go to a switch to boost it. Um, CAD 6 goes 140 meters before you actually do it. So if you've got a, a shed at the back of the property and you're putting, say, CCDB cameras, and it was 100 meters or a bit over 100 meters in length, um, you would run, you would run um, CAD 6 cable to do the data connection for that if that's what you're doing. So we can actually give you all this advice on what cables you need on your project. Once we know what you're trying to achieve, we can actually help you design the system and how you run the cables. The cables on the bottom, these are security cables and they come in a four core security and a six core security. And these are a multi-strand cable. They're different to the CAD5. These are a solid strand cable. These are a multi-strand. Um, this one here is a 14020, which is 14 strands of cable and it's four different conductors. Typically, this will come in a red and a black and a white and a blue. It does come in some other color formats as well. And the six core version just has an extra pair of cores in there. So this is used for things like wiring up sirens, PIRs, keypads, anything on a security system. And this is the correct cable to use on a security system, not, not CAT5. This is not des really designed to use on a security system. You really need to use multi-strand because of the way the connectors work. But we'll do another video basically about how to connect and join cables in a later video. But I just wanted to basically touch base and let you know that you can buy any of these cables and some specialized cables as well. We sell them all on our website, or if it's not on the website, uh, we have access to it. So just send us a message and we can basically tell you what's available because there is versions of the CAD5, which is what they call the flooded CAD5, which is an underground CAD5. So if you're burying it in the ground, it's got a silicon grease in it. So it's basically stops water egress getting into the cable. So this is just like I said, a quick example of what the cables, knowing the right cable, if you use the wrong cable for the wrong purpose, you will have problems. So it's better off to actually get some advice from us on which cable to use to make your project work perfectly. Don't forget, you can see all our products on our online store at www.technoworks.com.au. Any questions, please send us to us. Thank you.